Hello Cancer, how are you? Welcome to my channel Star 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 and welcome to your reading. So Cancer, this is your reading for the month of March and this is a general reading. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Energies might be vice versa and time is fluid. Cancer, I would appreciate if you would hit like, share and subscribe and comment down below if you find yourself getting resonated with this reading. I would also request you to hit that notification bell so that you will be notified whenever I upload the video. There is an extended reading for this one. The link for the same is in description box and comment section. In the extended, we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you, what action they will take towards you, what is the likely conclusion between you and this person. Okay, so Cancer, what I'm doing is I'll shuffle the cards. I'm shuffling the cards. I'll lay them down and then we'll see what is your energy, what is the energy of the person you're thinking about, you're dealing with, what are the things that you need to know for the month of March, Cancer? So what you need to know for the month of March, we have Tower, okay? So some situations are ending over here. Uh, possibly, <sighs> these situations should have ended up a long time back, uh, but they were either being dragged by you or by someone else, most likely dragged by someone else. I feel like you wanted to exit from this situation quite some time ago, but the other person was not ready for this exit, okay? But now universe is kind of interfering and universe is like, that's it. The situation is not serving neither of you and uh, it's time that I interfere. It's time that I take things in my hand and it's time that I end the situation. So I see that... For some of you, there is going to be a forceful ending of a certain situation. As far as you are concerned, I don't see you getting bothered by this forceful ending because you anyway wanted to end the situation. However, the other person is kind of uh, looking bothered or uh, the this end will have a huge impact on this other person. This can be a romantic ending. This can be a... Um, work related ending possibly you're you're quitting a job or you're selling off a business ten of cups now you understand why universe has interfered over here because you are meant to be with someone else there is someone who is about to enter a long-term situation is about to happen in your life cancer and that is why universe is like that's it i'm taking things in my hand eight of cups You have clearly left something or someone cancer, okay? There was a lot of emotional attachment to this situation, but I also see that there is a lot of determination and uh, desire to get out of the situation, irrespective of the fact that there was emotional involvement, emotional attachment. But uh, there is something that has kind of pushed you to take this decision to walk away or break down a certain situation. You're clearly walking away from something. You have walked away from something or someone. Or you're going to walk away from something or someone. Because there are better situations that are knocking your doors, Cancer. Better situations are waiting for you. I also see that you possibly might go on a solo travel somewhere, Cancer, to heal yourself, okay? There is a lot of heaviness inside you. I mean, before you start with a new situation, you know that you need to clear some prior energy. And currently, I feel like there is some kind of heaviness inside you, okay? Uh, you might have changed your hobbies as well. Is anyone stalking you, Cancer? Or maybe there was someone in your life who was kind of controlling you. You felt suppressed. Uh, or you felt kind of uh, not yourself when you, were, when, you, when you were with this person. Or you were in that situation. I feel like you are taking, you are starting a solo journey right now. So for uh, some of you, if you have quit your job, you have quit your job because you want to get into entrepreneurship. If you have quit your jobs, I don't see you starting another job. And even if you start another job, that job is not going to remain for long. 
yes you are meant to walk down a solo journey cancer you are meant to become an entrepreneur in fact you are meant to lead many people and uh, the journey of the leader is kind of uh, it's is pretty individualistic it's pretty much solo it's different from uh, the people that follow him or her okay and you are the leader you are going to lead you are going to lead many people in your life if there were any kind of botherations around money cancer uh, those botherations are ending okay i'm hearing the word jackpot okay i heard the word jackpot like either you're going to win some kind of a lottery or either you're going to a big amount of money is coming towards you okay and this this sounds unexpected like you are not expecting this kind of money or you are not expecting your luck to go in your favor but a big sum of money is coming towards you um uh, i don't know how it's coming towards you but i see that either it's coming through your one of your sources of income or it's coming through inheritance it's coming through if you are fighting any kind of litigation suit it's going to go in your favor okay so it's money is coming as a result of winning this litigation suit apart from that i'm also hearing that uh, for some of you i don't know uh, i see a change of profession over here are you kind of uh, making money in stock market or something okay because i see that you will be pursuing a profession which has a huge potential like huge mega huge potential okay so either you are running a business with few people and this business has is it's a service oriented business and it you are making really good amount of money or you are making or or for some of you this is very individualistic you are running uh, you are running a youtube channel or possibly you are uh, into stock market or something whatever you are doing next is very individualistic you might hire people under you but uh, they won't be much okay but the amount of money that you will be making you will be raking in lot of money so you will be ha- you will be a part of those unique professions where the amount of money you can charge or amount of money you can earn can, can be humongous i'm also hearing some of your doctors service oriented uh, job or services you will be providing for some of you your counselors and consultants like you are charging per hour basis and you can demand that much amount of money you will be able to demand that much amount of money and if you are not demanding that much amount of money the king of pentacles is kind of a reminder for you to uh, understand what your true potential is okay king of pentacles is kind of a uh yeah this is this card is a reminder that you can make a really good amount of money and if you are not commanding i mean if you are not charging that much then it's it's kind of a reminder that you are undervaluing yourself okay your value is very high you can demand you can command a big amount of money in your in your business in your services all right what else you need to know cancer what else you need to know cancer what else you need to know cancer what else you need to know temperance balance is getting restored after a lot of changes and intense changes cancer balance is finally getting restored okay intense changes you will experience some major changes in the month of march or possibly you have already experienced those changes in the month of jan and feb and now finally in the month of march that uh, that balance is getting restored now okay your life was kind of sh- like it it kind of shook for some time okay you experienced a graph like this a high and low and high and low and high and low okay so there were these extreme changes extreme highs and extreme lows okay it kind of 
took away a lot from you it kind of drained you to a large extent okay but finally now uh, the the balance is getting restored stability is getting restored you will find your energy back to normal now okay <clears throat> let's see what else what else uh, you need to know for the month of march what else you need to know death and rebirth there are major changes that are happening cancer there are uh, extreme changes that are happening for some of you if you were sick cancer if you were sick in the month of jan or feb and it kind of got the sickness got prolonged expect it to end that situation to end and you will recover from that in the month of march you will see a massive recovery in the month of march okay again devil is uh, i see a lot of obsession towards work i see you becoming workaholic i see you developing multiple sources of income five of wands is kind of uh you becoming competitive you becoming yeah i i see you getting into your spirits are high you are becoming ambitious maybe you are going to achieve certain goals in the month of march and that is going to uplift your mood that is going to help you become more and more inspired and motivated towards what you want to achieve in in your life okay if you have achieved first target you will be like yes i know i can achieve this target let me achieve the next one yes i can know i can achieve that let me achieve the further one okay so i'm not saying that you're going to become greedy but you will become ambitious for sure okay you want to achieve higher tag uh, targets in your life okay uh what else you need to know cancer what else you need to know as far as your love life is concerned what else you need to know star card you will be in the spotlight cancer in the month of march okay so anyways uh, because you are under the spotlight you will attract lot of people towards you there are so many major arcanas from this deck we have star then we have death and rebirth and devil and from the earlier deck we have uh, tower and we have temperance so four five five major arcanas for you for the month of march so you are under spotlight uh, cancer and you will of course attract lot of people towards you so you don't have to put any extra efforts okay so you are anyway under the spotlight hanged man someone is watching you already cancer someone is already watching you someone is waiting for the right time and the right time is not far away okay like universe is kind of orchestrating lot of things behind the curtain and i see someone coming towards you someone was waiting for you for a real long time cancer whoever this person is possibly you might be aware of who this person is empress you are attracting lot of abundance you are attracting abundance you are attracting positivity in your life people who are manifesting pregnancy and expansion of family march is a very favorable period for that okay march is a very favorable period to start the process three of swords number 3 is is absolutely important uh it's a kind of a message with three of swords it's more of a message uh than any kind of event that do not allow past to affect your future cancer because a lot of positive things are coming towards you and you are not ready to believe that because so much of intense uh a rock bottom situations have happened in the recent past okay that something wonderful is about to happen you kind of are taking your own time to believe that yes something wonderful can also happen in my life okay so do not allow the energy of the past to impact your present and your future like really amazing things are going to happen in your life wonderful situations are about to happen in your life and if anyone or anything is getting removed it is only getting removed because it's not meant to stay in your life he or she is not meant to stay in your life that situation is not meant to stay in your life
Heal yourself, Cancer. You need some healing. Put some efforts towards healing yourself. Okay? Let the universe know that you want to heal yourself from the situation. Unless and until you convey to the universe that I want to heal myself, universe will not become proactive in helping you out. You have to let the universe know that, yes, I want to heal myself from this past situation. Help me in that process. Okay? All right. I hope uh, this resonates, uh, Cancer. Hit like, share and subscribe and uh, comment down below. Okay? This is, these are some positive cards for the month of March. The link for the extended is in description box and comment section. In the extended, we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you. What action they will take towards you. What is the likely conclusion between you and this person. Alright, take care and have a great time ahead.